I know we all sometimes want to be able to have the opportunity to go back in time and make a decision that, well, we, we kind of passed off on and, well, we probably passed up on quite a bit of potential success. And specifically in this video, we're going to be talking about Gala Music Notes. Now, for those of you who've been with and watching the channel for a long time, when we first talked about Gala, obviously I know it was an expensive project to get involved in. It was around $23,000 to buy a Gala node. Well, the price is now close to $100,000 for that Gala node, so you would have 4X your initial investment. But we're not here to talk about the past. We're going to talk about the present and the future of Gala music nodes, which are, I would consider, much more affordable and have a lot of opportunity, but we're gonna talk about some of the concerns I have, some of the risks that are out there, and as to whether Gala Music is going to be successful or not, and should you consider getting one of these notes. That being said, if you do find value in the video, all I ask in return is you smash, destroy, and annihilate. We're adding all three this time, <laughs> the, smash, the, the smash button. The, I've said it too many times. I don't think I can understand what I'm saying, but uh, smash the like button. If you've yet to subscribe, hit the subscribe button. And if you do want early access to new crypto mining opportunities, crypto giveaways, crypto miners, all that and more, you'll find a link down below in the description for that private discord. Without further ado, let's jump in the video. Now, most of us, when we think about Gala, we typically think about Gala games, primarily one of arguably the top three metaverse play to earn games in the world of crypto. And particularly when we think about running a node, we think about a founder's node, which there is a limited supply of, and the passive income that revolves around that, which when we first talked about it, it was around $50 a day. Now, based on the token price, uh, it's going to be around 100 to 120 fifty dollars per day uh from what i've gathered on the average now the one kind of thing that i wish i could go back and say man what if i had set up a gala founders node uh for their metaverse slash gaming overall ecosystem i know i'd be profiting quite a bit and in the end i'd have the opportunity eventually to sell my node and now the value of it has gone from twenty three thousand to nearly a hundred thousand dollars but I don't really want to live in the past. I want to talk about the opportunity that is presented to us at this point with Gala Music because while when as we saw the cost for a Gala Games Founders node is 283 Gala tokens which is an equivalent of around $96,000, the overall uh, expense for a Gala Music node is $1200 roundabout with some Ethereum gas fees. Now and particularly in this video, I'm not going to give you the step-by-step -step guide of how to set that up. Uh, I will do that in a follow-up video, but I want to really lay out the information that you need to know to go do your own research, go do your own due diligence, because this is not financial advice. So what is Gala Music? It was a very recent announcement, and in fact, the nodes themselves just came to, or the license to run a node uh, became able to be purchased about three to four days ago. So Gala, as we know, is in the gaming sphere, but now they have started to venture into the music industry. And as we know, it's kind of been one of those industries within the world of crypto when it comes to decentralization that not a lot of projects out there have been able to do successfully when it comes to decentralizing music, other than a couple which we'll talk about towards the end and some of the competition Gala is going to experience. But Overall, this space really isn't at all very, you know, there's not a lot of people in a lot of projects in this space. And of all projects, Gala Games really does, or Gala has themselves set up for success because of the overall ecosystem they've already built. So they're far ahead of the rest of the competition that's trying to build that community around the project. They already have that. So when it comes to the decentralization of games and Web 3.0, uh, what Gallic Music is attempting to do is also to decentralize the music network and to be supported by music fans like me and you to operate a Node software license from their home computers. And also you have the opportunity to earn while listening 
to music with Gala Music. It's very interesting. There's a lot of details we're still unknown of, uh, but as much of the details that I'm, we have available, I'll be providing within this video. So run, collect, earn. Operating a music node makes you a pioneer. You're not just part of the Gala Music Network. You're what powers it when you contribute to the ecosystem by keeping your music node online. You are rewarded. We're gonna talk about the rewards of gala music notes how much you can earn and is it actually worth it the process is going to be extremely simple and if you do have a gala games founders node it's going to be pretty much the same thing and if you are interested or curious and you're wanting to have both you can run them on the the same computer that you're running uh your gala founders node on currently so uh, the process is pretty simple. You purchase the license to operate a node. The node software is quick to set up and simple to run. And you pair music NFTs with your music node to earn. Like I said, because all of this is not even about a week old even, uh, there's still going to be a lot of unknowns as to how this is all going to work. Because at this point, all we have available is the opportunity to purchase the license for the node. Uh, and as you'll see, uh, this is a, a screenshot that I took from my email um, talking about, hey, once you go and purchase, it will send you an email stating, hey, you're licensed to operate a player node. Uh, tell you a little bit more here and there uh, within the email. But it does. we don't currently have the, the setup as to actually running these nodes and earning from these nodes yet. So realize that is going to be something that's coming in the future. So if you love all kinds of music and want to support the growth of the decentralized music network, which is better for artists and fans, this node is for you. So you get the chance to be surprised with an NFT from every drop on Gala Music. So play music NFTs from every genre and artist on the platform, pair any music NFT with your node to earn rewards, and be one of the first pioneers on the network. Now, uh, some of these things are gonna make a little bit more sense as we get into the actual earning structure of these nodes and as to how much you get paid out because uh, payouts aren't currently happening right now. It's just in the process of buying nodes. Now, if you are interested in buying a node, like I said, I'll be doing a full video on that, but currently there aren't any limits as to how many nodes can be bought. Currently it is still active, but when it comes to the incredible, uh, just kind of popularity that it's already garnered, you can see that just for $5,000, you can own one Snoop Dogg song on the blockchain. He acquired Death Row Records brand, and that is gonna be the label where he is going to be making his debut. This is put out by Rolling Stone, talking about the Snoop stash boxes are limited to 25,000 and are available for $5,000. The uh, stash box includes one of the 17 tracks uh, track NFTs from BODR, and there will only be 1,470 NFTs for each song. The sale ends on Sunday at midnight uh, Pacific Standard Time. BODR will also arrive non NFT style on February 11th. So uh, that is w when people are interested in Gala Music, right? Uh, obviously, there can be a fantastic ecosystem for artists to be able to come to, but do you have artists coming? Because you, you could have a great ecosystem, but a not enough demand, then, well, no one really ends up becoming successful. Well, the good thing is that as it stands right now, not only do you have Snoop Dogg, you have Maroon 5, you've got Steve Oki, you've got Head and Heart, you've got Kings of Leon, BT, and there's a couple of others. And, and it seems like almost every day uh, there's names of new artists and bands coming to the Gala Music uh, platform when it comes to the opportunity that it provides. So this is gonna be the player node license. Like I said, we'll be talking about this in a future video, talking about this is required to actually operate a node. You can see the pricing of it, but let's talk about the actual earnings potential with this, because if you didn't know, uh, Gala Games Founders nodes were sold around a $1,500 price point in the very beginning, and these nodes are being sold at around a $1,200 price point. So you can see the potential upside, but realize that until the actual adaptation happens, you're taking that risk because once you pay those Gala tokens to buy the license, you this non-refundable, it's gone. 
So there's $1,200 that you're risking into a project that could end up not going well at all. That's, that's kind of the uncertainty, but if we can tell from the past of the leadership, leadership behind Gal Games and the growth of the founder's notes going from $1,500 to $96,000 in value, this kind of showcases the potential value that Gala Music Notes have. So let's talk about this real quick about the player music notes and what they offer when it comes to this. So Gala Games expands on their idea of distributed servers by introducing Gala Music Notes. These function as nodes in the Gala Music ecosystem, serving up streaming music in the process. Node purchases are limited through though Holding more than one on the same system does not provide additional benefits. Music nodes work as kind of a king of jukebox streaming NFT tracks. To begin with, the node owners must hold their own NFTs in order to stream. But in the future, there will be the option for streamers to offer their node up for use by NFT holders with profit sharing between the two. Because you can pretty much go buy an NFT for one of these songs and anyone who streams that then you can partner as the NFT owner with the runner, the person who owns the node, and profit share between the two of you as he pretty much streams your music from your NFT. It's kind of uh, a mind-boggling kind of thing to wrap your head around, but um, this is, is a very early concept, and I think it does have a lot of potential for it. So when we talk about the uh, price point and earning structure, so the sales for Gaza, Gaza Gala music player nodes started February 11th. Cost is around 1200 and Gala tokens. Nodes cannot be sold or transferred once purchased. There will be no limit to the number of player nodes available. Owning a Gala music node also opens up the possibility of receiving free NFT track drops from new releases. Unlike some other sales, there will be no frantic rush to buy a player node license unless you want to make sure you don't miss any of the NFT drops. There's no indication from the team that the node price will change or that the nodes will be discontinued. That's kind of one of the, the concerns that you're going to have is there's no scarcity. We know with founders nodes, there's a 50,000 uh, limit of uh, founders nodes. There's no limit as of yet from that we've been told from Gala as to the scarcity potential uh, and the value that these nodes provide just from the scarcity standpoint. So let's talk about the tokenomics real quick because this really gets into the meat of it. So while we don't have a white paper detailed breakdown of the new Gala Music token, the team did give us a bit of a token payout breakdown. So rewards are paid in new Gala Music token. For each track played, the system mints 10 cents worth of Gala Music token. This newly minted token is distributed as follows. 45% to all owners of the track, split evenly, 10% to all nodes on the music network, also split evenly, evenly and 5% to the specific node playing the track. The remaining 50% goes to the artist. Each node only holds one instance of each track, so hoarding the tracks provides little benefit. Now, uh, specifically, they talk about the not sure as to the reason for the new token, unless they're planning on raising money from an IDO. But sales from Snoop Dogg release alone will bring in $125 million if it sells out. Um, but supposedly, Gala Music will also offer a listen to learn feature, listen to earn feature, where listeners earn tokens just for streaming music. I imagine this will be a pretty small drip, but getting paid to listen. To music is not a bad gig and I'll provide a link to the rest of this article if you are interested uh, in reading it in full detail on your own time but this is really what makes me excited about the potential right and that's really all it is right now uh, as we get more information on a daily basis I myself took the risk to purchase one of these nodes because I am a big believer in gala and the potential of the project when it comes to this. Now, if you simply type in into Google decentralized music, you're going to see there's a, a couple of different projects that are going to come up, such as uh, Audius, that's a very popular one, uh, it had a partnership with TechDoc. You're going to see one uh, recently talked about, Dequency raised 4.5 million to be build decentralized music licensing. So you're going to see a couple of other competitors, and this is really where my concern lies, is is Gala Music going to be able to break into this decentralized music 
atmosphere when it comes to crypto and how much of the market are they actually going to be able to capture and are they going to provide that appeal for artists to be able to come onto their platform now as we know right now there's about seven to eight artists already and this hasn't even been out for a full week so i'm interested to see as time goes on how this continues to develop but in the meantime i'll be keeping you guys up to date on how this continues to progress as soon as we can set up notes and in a follow-up video i'll do a step-by-step -step guide if you're interested in setting up one of these gala music nodes after of course you've done your research and your due diligence Feel free to follow that when that is posted but in the end i hope you did find this video valuable if you did all i ask in return you smash destroy and annihilate the like button for the youtube algorithm yet to subscribe hit the subscribe button turn on all notifications and if you do want early access you'll find a link down below in the description for that until next time guys stay invested